Rosemary with All Things Automotive, bringing you here today a 2015 Ford Focus SE. This vehicle features a 2-liter inline-four engine, and there have been no accidents or damages reported to Carfax. As we get closer here to the front of this small car, you'll be able to see that it is a sleek tuxedo black clear coat with chroma black accents as you'll be able to see there on the front row. We'll come around here to the side of this vehicle and take a look at its tires and wheels. This vehicle features silver 16-inch aluminum alloy wheels, and as for the tire treads, you have got a good amount of life left in them, but I'll get you those exact measurements in just a second, as this vehicle, along with all the other vehicles here at All Things Automotive, has undergone a new multi-point inspection, as well as received a fresh oil change, a new cabin air filter, and a new engine air filter. So you don't need to worry about replacing any of those anytime soon. Here on the ad seat mirror caps, you do have your turn signals integrated into those, and we'll now take a look here to the inside of this vehicle. Here on the inside of this car, you do have a lovely tan cloth upholstery on the seats for a smooth and comfortable ride. And like I had mentioned earlier, you do have those chrome and black accents making their way up the dashboard. While we're looking over here, I'll just open up the glove box and bring out the results of that multi-point inspection that I was talking about. And as you'll be able to see here on this inspection sheet, you do have green checks the entire way around. And as for your tire treads, you have 7.30 seconds in all of your tires. And as for your brake pads, you have 11.30 seconds in the front and 4.30 seconds in the rear. I'd also like to mention that with the purchase of this vehicle, you do get the original owner's manual with it as well. So if you have any questions after you buy it, you'll be able to look them up in there. We'll now continue around and take a look here at the rear occupant seating. As you'll be able to see back here, this vehicle can seat a total of five people. And for these rear occupants, you do have a small space here, as well as pockets on the backs of both of those front seats. Down on the floors, you do have carpeted floor mats to help keep your floors nice and clean. And over here on the doors, all of the doors do have cup holders in them, as well as power windows. I'll just close that door and we'll continue around to take a look here at the rear of this car. On the rear of this vehicle, you do have a backup camera to help you whenever you're parking or going in reverse. And I'll just pop the tailgate to show you how much space you have here in the rear area. As you'll be able to see back here, you do have a significant amount of space to haul some pretty large items. And those seats in front do fall down to give you even more space if you so desire. Those seats in front also have top and bottom anchor tether points if you have little ones who need car seats. And underneath the floorboards back here, you do have a spare tire if you're ever in a pinch. I'll just put the tailgate back down and we'll continue around to the driver's side. I would like to mention that with the purchase of this vehicle, you do get two keys for your convenience and to help prevent you from ever getting locked out. This car has powered windows, powered mirrors, and powered door locks. And as for the driver's seat, you do have six-way manual seating adjustments, so you can move the seat forwards, backwards, up, down, and then tilting the seat forward and back. You also have a telescopic steering wheel with this vehicle, meaning you can move it in and out as well as up and down to fit you as you like. And to the left of that steering wheel is just your dashboard backlight controls as well as your headlight controls. And I'll just get in this vehicle and turn it on for you. This vehicle does have an automatic transmission and it uses its key to start as opposed to a push to start. And now that the engine is running and the dashboard's lit up, you'll be able to see that this vehicle has about 71,358 miles on it. We'll take our attention over here to the left side of the steering wheel, as over here are your dashboard navigation buttons, so with these you can cycle through all the different information and services this vehicle provides to you. And underneath those dashboard navigation buttons are your cruise controls. And on the right side of the steering wheel you do have your ROM controls as well as your Bluetooth and call controls, as this vehicle does have hands-free Bluetooth. We'll now take a look here to the center of this vehicle. Here in the center of the vehicle you do have a lovely LCD display, and I'll just throw it in reverse to show you that backup camera in action. Right beneath that display, you do have a variety of buttons for it. Beneath all of that, you do have your climate controls, a small space for something like your phone, and a USB charging port. A bit farther back, you do have a power outlet, your main gear shift here, two cup holders, parking brake, and then your main storage compartment back here with another power outlet, USB charging port, and aux cord plug-in inside. We'll now move on to the last section of this video. Here in the last section of this video, we do want to address that this vehicle is pre-owned, so we'll be looking around for any blemishes, nicks, or stains. We know a lot of our customers come from very far away, and we want you to know what you're getting with the purchase of this vehicle, imperfections, and all. So as I'm looking around the inside of the vehicle, you do have some general wear in several places, such as some stains here on the rear seats, and some discolorations on the visor, 
few discolorations there as well. But other than those, nothing is really standing out to me. There are no odors or scents whatsoever. So we'll move along to take a look here now at the outside of this vehicle. We'll be looking up and down again for any of those imperfections, starting by coming along here to the front. Here along the front of this vehicle, we do have several nicks, most likely from stone chips. Stone chipping is extremely common. Almost every vehicle has some form of it. The only way you can really prevent it is just by not driving your vehicle. We did touch it up in a few spots, but it is there. Some of that nicking is happening on the back of that new cap as well. And on that handle. There as well as there. Now as we come along here to the rear of this vehicle, a place where I often tend to see imperfections is where the tailgate meets the bumpers. People don't take care of putting items in and taking items out. And as I look here, you do have quite a bit of wear here on the inside on this black plastic. Some scuffing happening all in that. And as for the bumper, you do have some scuffs and nicks on it as well. I'll just put the tailgate back down and we'll continue back around to the driver's side. A scuff there. And we are back to where we started. That generally concludes this video vehicle tour. This vehicle has a lot of great features to offer. If you're interested in a black small car with the ability to seat five, fold down seats with a good amount of space in the rear, a rear backup camera, carpeted floor mats, two keys, a spare tire, cloth upholstery, and hands-free Bluetooth, this is a good option for you. If you're interested in this vehicle, come and check it out at All Things Automotive, located at 21518. Great Cove Road, McConnellsburg, PA. Or you can give us a call at 717-485-4224. You can also check out this small car and other listings on our website at www.allthingsautomotive.com. Thank you for watching this video and have a great day.